Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh and salam sejahtera. I'm Arif from the School of Medical Imaging, Faculty of Health Science, University Sultan Zainal Abidin. On behalf of my team members, I will be presenting to you our project entitled Development of Interactive 3D Virtual Reality in Radiography Education. So these are our team members with five lecturers and me from the School of Medical Imaging, Faculty of Health Science, UNIDA Campus Gongbada. In coping with the fast-paced Industrial Revolution 4.0, the Malaysian Ministry of Education has introduced future education models that incorporate the use of technology in education. One of these models is virtual education where students learn in a virtual environment. However, most virtual education software and radiography education is relatively expensive. This problem poses a challenge to us where financial resources are limited. Therefore, to overcome this problem, we have developed a version of interactive 3D virtual reality that can be used in radiography education. The uniqueness of our project is that we only use free software in developing the interactive 3D virtual environment. And for this project, we only need a mobile phone, a freely available Google Street View application, and a computer. What we first did was take a panoramic image of radiography examination room using the Google Street View application installed on the mobile phone. Next, we transferred the panoramic image to the computer where we edited the image using an open source learning platform to create interactive virtual environments. Students will then be able to view the virtual environment that we have created through their mobile phones mounted on the VR goggle. Here is a short video of what we have done. This is an MRI room for students view when they wear the VR goggle. When they move their heads around, the environment will also move. Students can also interact with the virtual objects they see to make learning more immersive. This will help students to learn things they see in that room. We have also included a video to help students learn better. Once students are done with a room, they can virtually move to the next one. Now, we are in a general x-ray room. The same thing as the previous room, students can look around by turning their heads. Once they are done, they can move to another room. Now, the students are in fluoroscopy room. And just as before, students can look around and interact with objects in the virtual environment. The main benefit of doing this is that students can start learning before going for they are practical and this is particularly crucial for the first year students who have not been well exposed to the clinical settings. It is also important to note that all hospitals are equipped with the examination room shown in this video. Thus, through this innovative e-learning approach, students will be able to virtually enter rooms that may not be available in some hospitals. But at the moment, we have not yet formally tested our project on the students as this has just been developed. We aim to incorporate our project into the next semester curriculum. Nonetheless, we have tested this project on a few of the students to see what they think of our work. Here is one of the feedback from our student. Hello everyone, my name is Nikki and I'm a first year radiography student from UNISA. Today I would like to share my thoughts on virtual radiography which I found very interesting because it allows me to feel as if I'm standing inside a hospital room and interacting with the facilities even though I'm only at home. Learning this way is much more enjoyable and engaging as compared to the normal classroom lectures. I would also like to recommend this project to add more examination room and interactive objects. It would be even more exciting if I could freely move around the room and examine a virtual patient. That is all from me. Thank you. This project is not yet ready for commercialization and is still in the developing stage where we want to add more features based on students' feedback. However, when the project is complete, the software can be marketed to the local and international institutions offering radiography program. Our main goal is to market our product at a price that is affordable to local universities. We believe we could achieve this as our method is cost effective. At the moment, our project has won a bronze award in the UNISA Carnival on e-learning 2022. 
And as for the publication, we have not yet published our work, but we have prepared the manuscript and plan to publish it in the Journal of Radiography. So to wrap things up, in this project we have developed an e-learning material using a cost-effective method that can be used in radiography education. So do look forward to this project because this method is very cost-effective and will surely help students to gain more meaningful experience in radiography education. So that is all from me. I'm Arif Asbullah bin Hamdani. Thank you for listening.